you are guaranteed to see at least one magazine cover that you've never seen before. Let's check out some interesting sports magazine sales from the month of July 2024. All right, we're going to start with this 1994 Slam Magazine. This is actually issue number two for Slam Magazine, and we've got the Rain Man, Sean Kemp, throwing it down for the Seattle Supersonics. It's a CGC 8.5, and this sold on Golden Auctions for $323. From 2001, how about Basketball America, the National Basketball Monthly? It's a special recruiting issue, and that is none other than a young LeBron James on the cover. This one sold ungraded on Golden Auctions for $128. From 1989, it's an early copy of Sports Illustrated for Kids, and that is Wayne Gretzky on the cover. This one sold on eBay for $55. It did mention that there was a Michael Jordan sports card on the interior. From 1951, that was the rookie year for Mickey Mantle, and here he is on the cover of Baseball Magazine. This one sold ungraded on eBay for $277. From 2024, this is the most recent monthly magazine for PSA. Of course, they like to do the variant covers. Pretty cool, especially since they just announced they're going to be grading magazines in the near future. And this is LeBron James on the cover. This is the Gold Cracked Ice variant, limited to only 100 copies, and it sold on eBay for $160. This one's not sports, but it's interesting. It is the Source magazine from 1996, and you have Tupac on the cover. It's a CGC 8.0, and this one sold on Golden Auctions for $580. From 1992, Money Player, $7 million man Ryan Stanberg is baseball's salary king for now, and this is the first Sports Illustrated cover for Ryan Sandberg, Hall of Famer for the Chicago Cubs. It's a CGC 9.0 copy, sold on eBay for $750. From 2019, Joe Burrow on the cover of Sports Illustrated before he got his new haircut. This is his first Sports Illustrated cover, and it has been autographed, authenticated by Fanatics. This one sold on eBay for $293. From 1970, this is Steve Prefontaine, his first and only Sports Illustrated cover. And this is a subscription copy with the label removed, but people love Pre. This one sold ungraded on eBay for $40. And we're sticking with the subscriptions. How about this 1956 Mickey Mantle first Sports Illustrated cover? It's graded at a CGC 7.5, and it sold for $999 on eBay. From 1971, you've got a beautiful Willie Mays cover here with the Sporting News. It has been autographed by the Say Hey Kid, Rest in Peace, and this one sold on eBay for $150. From 2024, Slam Magazine celebrating the new NBA champs, Boston Celtics. You've got Jalen Brown, Finals MVP, alongside teammate Jason Tatum. This is the gold medal version, limited to only 94 printed copies. This one sold on eBay for $140. Gotta love anything Wayne Gretzky from the 1970s, and that would include this magazine cover of the Edmonton Report. It's a subscription copy, and this one sold ungraded on eBay for $43.32. From 1972, we are going chess, people. Bobby Fischer, where is he? Where is he? I don't know. First cover, CGC 7.0. Shout out Sherry O'Terry, Will Farrell. This one sold on eBay for $275. From 1949, Joe DiMaggio on the cover of Sport Magazine. It's a CGC 7.5. Jolt and Joe, a little underrated in my opinion. This one went on eBay for $129. From 1982, we got Ricky Henderson. It is his first Sports Illustrated cover. And this is another subscription. It's got the label removed, graded as a CGC 7.5. It's sold on eBay for $250. Very unique one here. This is from 1984. It was put out by Nike, and it is a price list of the Nike shoes. You've got to assume that the Air Jordans are on the inside of this one, and it's graded as a CGC 9.2, sold in auction on eBay with 36 bids for $201. And sticking in the same vein, we've got another 1984 Nike publication. This is promoting the shoe show, the 1984 shoe show. You actually got some athletes on here. Moses Malone, Dan Fouts, I believe that's John McEnroe up there. And this one's graded as a CGC 8.0, sold on eBay for $199. From 
sold in auction with 29 bids on eBay for $202.50. From 2023, this is Cooper Flag on the cover of Slam Magazine. And uh, his hype has really, really been growing, especially with some of the uh, the Olympic trials uh, here recently. And Cooper Flag holding his own against some of the big boys. And this is his first slam cover. This is the gold medal edition, limited out of 94. He will be bringing his talents to Duke University next season. And this one sold raw on eBay for $400. From 2013, this is a massively underrated uh, but also sneaky coveted slam cover and is the first slam cover for Steph Curry. This is a subscription copy and it sold ungraded on eBay for $50. From 1949, Police Gazette magazine, and you got a trio of absolute stud Hall of Famers, Ted Williams, Joe DiMaggio, and Stan Musial. This one sold raw on eBay for $40. From 1979, this was the NCAA Men's Basketball Final Four program. And uh, let me just remind you, the 1979 National Championship game featured Michigan State and Magic Johnson versus the, the Indiana State Sycamores and Larry Bird. This one sold on eBay for $121.50. From 1954, how about Hall of Famer Y.A. Tittle? Old school quarterback. This is his first Sports Illustrated cover. I believe this was the first NFL Hall of Famer ever to be featured on the cover of Sports Illustrated. This was only the 15th issue that Sports Illustrated ever put out. It's a CGC 8.0 and it sold on eBay for $600. Love that helmet. From 1993, Godzilla versus Barkley. It's been autographed by Barkley. I don't think Godzilla was available but the Charles signature has been authenticated by JSA, and this one sold ungraded on eBay for $120. From 1984, this is NBA Today, and it is their 1984 NBA Draft Guide. This was a, uh, this was a magazine publication that was on the inside of the larger NBA Today magazine. This was like an insert uh, of course, featuring the uh, covering the upcoming 1984 NBA draft, and that is Hakeem Olajuwon on the cover alongside Michael Jordan throwing it down for the North Carolina Tar Heels. This is a majorly desirable publication, and this one sold ungraded on eBay for $725. From 1966, you got Bart Starr on the cover of Sports Illustrated. It's not his first cover, but it's a great looking one. CGC 8.0 copy, and it sold for $750 on eBay. From 2000, lots of tennis fans loved Anna Kornikova. Maybe more for her looks than her playing, but this is a Sports Illustrated cover. Graded at a CGC 9.8, and it sold on eBay for $300. From 2005, Sports Illustrated for Kids, Possibly the WNBA greatest player of all time, that's Diana Taurasi. This has been autographed by Taurasi, authenticated and slabbed by Beckett. It is a subscription copy. It's sold on eBay for $360. And let's keep up the women power going on. This is from 1972. Awesome Newsweek magazine cover here featuring tennis great Chris Evert. And it's a CGC 8.0. This one sold on eBay for just south of $200. Any magazine cover prominently featuring Michael Jordan in his North Carolina uniform from that era is definitely collectible. That would include this copy of Eastern Basketball Magazine from 1984. It says Player of the Year Michael Jordan. It's a CGC 9.4 copy. And with 30 bids in auction on eBay, this one sold for $665. From 1986, it's Mike Tyson. This is his first cover appearance on The Ring magazine, popular boxing publication. This one's been autographed by Mike Tyson. It appears to be a newsstand. It's been authenticated and slabbed by Beckett. and sold for $650 on eBay. The Cardinals fan in me absolutely loves this one. This is 2009 and is the St. Louis Visitor's Guide. It's an awesome cover with Albert Pujols. This one's been autographed by Pujols, authenticated by JSA, sold on eBay for $349.99. From 2023, we've got Victor Wembanyama on the cover of Slam Magazine. It's not his first cover, but it is his first pro cover 
there with the San Antonio Spurs. This is the gold medal edition, limited to 94 copies. It's a CGC 9.6, and with 16 bids, this sold on eBay for $391. Next up, from 2003, how about the Pangos Dream Classic? Played at the UCLA Poly Pavilion on January 4th of 2003, the ninth annual, and uh, obviously playing in that game for St. Vincent St. Mary's, you had LeBron James, and this one sold ungraded on eBay for $40. From 2010, this is Phillies Magazine, and you've got Hall of Famer Roy Halladay on the cover. Of course, he is deceased, had a very early and untimely death, and that makes this autographed copy a little more valuable. This one sold on eBay for $89. From 1997, Jackie Robinson on the cover of Sports Illustrated, 17 days in May, when Jackie Robinson proved he was not just a pioneer, but a star. Believe it or not, this is, if I'm not mistaken, the very first Sports Illustrated cover for Jackie Robinson. For Jackie Robinson. That's right, 1997, even though it was in the late 40s that he broke the color barrier. Uh, it wasn't until nearly 50 years later that he made his first Sports Illustrated cover. This is a CGC 9.6 copy. It sold on eBay for $750. Here's another first cover, although a little bit more timely in his career. And this is Albert Pujols smashing in St. Louis. A uh, terrible photo that they posted here on this eBay sale, but it is a nice looking cover. CGC 9.6 sold on eBay for $444. From 1965, Jim Brown on the cover of Time Magazine. This is a subscription copy with the label removed, graded as a CGC 7.0, and sold for $225 on eBay. Now, how about this one? These are two people that I would not have expected to see on a magazine cover together in the year 1995. That is Michael Jordan and Ichiro Suzuki. Folks, Ichiro did not come to the Major League Baseball organization until 2001 when he won both the rookie of the year and the mvp that season but of course he was a star in japan previously and uh, pretty cool to see him on the cover with mj in uh excuse me this is march 1996 and this one sold ungraded on ebay for 159 dollars and 65 cents from 1928, almost 100 years ago, we had MLB Hall of Famer Rogers Hornsby on the cover of Time Magazine. This is a CGC 7.0 copy and it sold on eBay for $399.99. Who had a subscription to Open Road Magazine in 1953? Obviously, this guy did, and this was Bob Cousy on the cover, and this one's been autographed by Cousy and sold on eBay for $106.50. From 1974, I've often said that Sport Magazine had some really interesting covers in the 1970s. Not sure how much I love this one, but it definitely is interesting. This is Dave DeBusher, and it's a subscription copy. It's been autographed by DeBusher, authenticated by JSA, and it sold on eBay for $72.98. And this is one of the first magazine covers I've seen with Caitlin Clark in her WNBA uniform, it is Rise Magazine, Women in Sports. It's been autographed by Caitlin Clark, and this one sold on eBay for $399.99. From 2003, we've got another female superstar, and that's Mia Hamm, one of the all-time soccer greats. This was her first solo cover, and it's a nice CGC 9.8 copy, sold on eBay for $427.74. Here's a big LeBron cover graded at CGC 9.8. This is Sports Illustrated from 2005 when they asked best ever, and it sold on eBay for $802.02. Love this 1986 cover from Inside Sports, Larry Bird and Magic Johnson. It's a CGC 9.4 copy, and it sold on eBay for $345. From 1957, this is Men. Your Goodyear Dealers Magazine, and that is, of course, Mickey Mantle on the cover. This one sold on eBay for $74.99. And this one's a little bit random here. This is a Chicago Bulls program from 1966. It's actually uh, featuring a game against Wilt Chamberlain and the 76ers. But on the cover, it has been signed by a Chicago football legend, Gail Sayers, and this one sold on eBay for $199.99. 
from 1971. This is the first Sports Illustrated cover for Hall of Famer Fergie Jenkins. This one is so tough to find a newsstand, I know, because I've looked before. You can pretty much never find this one, but here it is. It's a newsstand copy of Fergie Jenkins' first Sports Illustrated cover, sold on eBay, ungraded for $79.99. From 2018, Patrick Mahomes, the best quarterback in the game today. This is his first Sports Illustrated cover. It's a CGC 9.6, sold on eBay for $415. And rounding it out this month, we're going to finish with this 1949 Players Golf Monthly Magazine, and that is golfing legend Ben Hogan on the cover. It has been autographed by Ben Hogan, authenticated by JSA, and sold on eBay for $449. All right, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. If you have not yet done so, please subscribe to this channel. I appreciate likes and comments, and until the next video, we'll see you next time.